I remember one time when I was a kid, uh, I was playing with a friend, and uh, we were discussing, you know, what we would do if we could take parts from animals and uh, have them ourselves and have parts from different animals. And I remember we were throwing out all kinds of fun ideas, but, and then my friend said, you know what, I would have the lungs like a crab, so I could breathe in the water and out of the water. It's very true because crabs are very amphibious in that way, they can breathe in the water and out of the water. Uh, to a certain extent, which I'll explain in here and how that actually works. Um, so what we have here is the Atlantic blue crab. Uh, this is actually a very uh, common meal crab, very tasty supposedly. Um, and they appear all over the east coast I believe. But um, very common and very interesting and very pretty. Look at that, they get their name from that beautiful blue color. But okay, we're not here to talk about blue, we're here to talk about crabs and how they breathe. Basically, with crabs it's not so much of they can breathe in water and out of water, they have gills, so they take in water and they filter oxygen out of it, like a fish, right? Similar to that, and they're, they're filtering through with these gills through this water to get oxygen and get nutrients and stuff that they can breathe with. So that's how they breathe in the water, but how about out of the water, like right now? Oh gosh, he's trying to pinch me. How do they breathe out of the water? So, you know, if you think about a human, we can dive into the water and we hold our breath, right? We hold a bunch of air in and we dive into the water and that air will keep us sustained for a little while and the more air we can suck in, the longer we can stay underwater. Uh, with crabs, it's kind of similar. Get this, this is pretty crazy. What they do is they'll actually take in a whole bunch of water, right? A whole bunch of oxygen-rich water from the ocean, this stuff, and they'll suck that in and they'll hold it. So while we hold our breath, they hold their water, and they can use that water, and they can keep on filtering through that water to get as much oxygen as they can. There's some crabs that don't even live in the water, they live literally almost entirely on the land, and just in moist spots where they can just get their gills wet enough to start taking oxygen out of the moisture. So, I uh, hope I answered the question for you. Uh, crabs really, really are amazing, really, really interesting creatures. I hope I taught you a thing or two about uh, how they breathe and how that works. I'll see you next time.